everyone, my name is Jessie and welcome back to my channel. And so last year I did a trick by collection video and so many people really enjoyed it that I thought it would be fun to make a part two because I have definitely added to my collection since making that video. And if you want to check that out, I'll link it in the description box below. But I just wanted to show you some of the new trick bits that I ended up buying. And so without further ado, let's get into it. Okay, so for the first couple of buds, I kind of already featured in previous videos, but I've never gotten into detail about them. So I'm just gonna run through these first couple of ones kind of quickly. And the first one is Magnolia Table by Joanna Gaines and then Magnolia Table Volume 2. You guys, I am obsessed with these trick bits and I have made so many recipes from these. And I will try and make a playlist of all of those videos in the description box below, so definitely check that out. I love all the recipes in these. They're super easy, super fast, and absolutely delicious to make, and I highly recommend investing in these trick butts. Okay, and so for the next trick butt, I made a couple of videos using this as well. I will try and make another playlist in the description box down below, and this is just Feed Me by Jesse James Stucker. This basically is kind of like a semi-homemade cook, but it's basically putting your own homemade twist on like pre-made items. Like say for example, you get like a rotisserie chicken from the deli in the grocery store, but you kind of like spice it up, make it your own, add items, add different seasonings. And so simple, but delicious ingredients and recipes just like that. And so, it's pretty simple. This is kind of new. I bought this back in like February or March. And so I definitely create some recipes, but not a ton. But I definitely want to make more from this. And so I'm excited about that. Okay, and so for the next cookbook, it is The New Frontier by The Pioneer Woman. I'm obsessed with watching her videos on the Food Network YouTube channel. And then of course all of her Instagram. And what I love so much about this cookbook is that not only is it like really easy to follow but they also have step-by-step -step pictures that way you can know what your dish is supposed to look like through each step and i think that that's really helpful when it if you're like new in the kitchen or if you never made this dish before or if you're just a visual learner having something visual to look at is really helpful and i really like this and as you can see i already have a couple of recipes that i want to recreate from here and so i'm super excited about this one because i'm obsessed with the pioneer woman Okay, so the next couple of cut buds are my brand new cut buds that I recently purchased. So I haven't really had a lot of time to go through them or recreate any of the recipes, but I'm really excited that I got them. And the first one is Molly on the Range by Molly Ye. And you guys, I really love watching her on the Food Network YouTube channel. She has so many amazing but simple recipes. Like she has like some pigs in a blanket and then she also has some... Um, but it's a challah bread that I really want to try and recreate. That she has some garlic knots and all of these delicious recipes that I'm really excited to try. And she just seems so nice and sweet. And then she also has some cake. And so I'm really down for trying to make this cake as well. And so I'm glad I got this one. Okay, so my final cookbook, again, I bought this when I bought my last book. And so I haven't had a chance to go through it, but I'm obsessed with it. And it is Dessert Person by Claire Salads. Okay, you guys, long story short, I was obsessed with Gourmet Mate on the Bon Appetit YouTube channel. And when I found out that Claire Savage was having not only her own YouTube channel, but she told me out with her own bake baking book, I was so excited about it. I was like trying to hold off and ask for it for my birthday, but I just couldn't. I just had to buy it myself because I can no longer wait. And there's like chocolate cake, there's um this Pits and blanket with like a brioche bread and I'm really excited about trying that brioche bread and oh my gosh I have so many recipes in here that I want to recreate and I cannot wait to try them out <laughs> okay and so that is basically all of my newer cookbooks that I've bought since my last cookbook collection video I really hope you enjoyed it and I hope that you found it informative and also, if there are any other cookbooks that you like that you want me to check out, definitely leave them in the comment section down below. And I would really be excited to see what kind of recommendations you made. But if you like this video and if you want to see me recreate any recipes from any of these cookbooks, be sure to like this video and be sure to subscribe so that you don't miss any of those videos whenever I do recreate some of these recipes. But until next time, I will see y'all later. 
拜。